It's not January 1st, but I want to wish you a Happy New Year! My name is India and today we are going to celebrate the Jewish New Year here in Israel. Right now, people all across the country are snacking on delicious treats, gathering with family, or attending prayer services at synagogues. And everywhere, you can hear this sound. This is what New Year's Eve feels like in Israel. According to the Jewish calendar, it is not 2021, but 5782. The Jewish New Year in Hebrew is called Rosh Hashanah, which in English translates to the head of the year. The Jewish calendar counts time differently from the calendar that we usually use. The Jewish New Year begins on the anniversary of the world's creation. To welcome the new year, there are a few traditions, like eating pomegranates and apples along with honey to start the year with sweetness. Where can you find these things? Well, just come with me to the Carmel Markets in Tel Aviv. אנשים לפני ראש השנה, לפני כמה ימים, וזה באים ממלאים, קונים, עושים נשמה עינן העולם, הרבה פירות. אם רוצים נשמה שהיא זכורה טובה וטרייה, זה לבוא לשוק בבוקר מוקדם, חבל על הזמן. Rosh Hashanah also has another name. It is called the Feast of Trumpets. This is the same sound we heard earlier. It comes from a shofar, an instrument made out of the horn of a ram. The blast of the shofar is a powerful way to start the new year. I must add that Rosh Hashanah marks a very holy time for the Jewish people. It comes exactly 10 days before the holiest day of the year. Yom Kippur, which is the day that the Jewish people ask for forgiveness. But for now, we are celebrating! And if you want to celebrate the new year too, you can start by getting some fruits and honey to share with your family. Then greet someone with the words Shana Tova. This is how you wish someone a happy new year in Hebrew. So there you have it. Welcome to year 5782. A year that we hope will bring peace and blessings, especially after all the chaos the world has recently experienced. Now we want to wish you a happy new year! Shana Tova! This is Rosh Hashanah. This is Inside Israel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.